Most days, the gators here in Port Aransas can be found here at the Leona Bell Turnbull Birding Center. There's signage asking people not to feed the wildlife, but leftover bones show there's still people illegally feeding these animals. This was the site back in October 2018. Several officers wrestling to contain a gator in Port Aransas. Today, gators still lounge at the birding center on the island, but the days of gator gazing could soon be over if people don't stop feeding them human food. There are some people bringing raw chicken or other items, food items for the alligators to eat. Not only is it unhealthy for the alligators, but Natural Preserve Manager Ray Mooney says feeding them could lead to a scary encounter or even an attack. We don't want the alligators to start walking out expecting something from people. See at the birding center here, you're, you're far enough away from the alligators where maybe it wouldn't be so much an issue, but they do venture out sometimes. Uh, like a couple weeks ago, they were out in some of the drainage ditches in Port Aransas, and you can be very close to them there. If they start to become a nuisance for the city, Mooney says Animal Control will have to find a permitted company to relocate the alligators to another natural area or sanctuary. And since feeding them is against city ordinance and state law, Mooney says game wardens and local law enforcement can give you a citation if you're caught illegally feeding any protected animals out here. They're happy, they're fe well fed by nature, so um, just come out and enjoy them. Brenda Matuti, Action 10 News, Corpus Christi.